Norman, tell us about Invent Awards 2017. Well, Invent Awards are our big set piece of the year. It's not all that we do, but it, but it's really uh, a, a crystallization of everything that we stand for. So this has been a, a nine-month nine process helping these groups keep developing and developing their pitch till they come tonight. And it's so much, for me, I've been doing this now for, what, 15 years. And to see the change in, the, in this place where 15 years ago it was some kids having fun, hoping to win 500 quid to go on holiday. Now, tonight, you'll see here is a bunch of people really, really striving to get their businesses off the ground. And tomorrow, if they win tonight, they'll be going to go, they'll go negotiating for, for real investment. So that's what it's about. Fantastic. Hi, Gavin. We're here at the Waterfront um, Conference Centre for the Invent Awards. What does it mean for Bank of Ireland UK to be at the awards this evening? Well, we're delighted, uh, Richard, to be here tonight um, as, as key sponsor. Um, you know, the, these businesses that have gone through, you know, grueling semi-finals, now the final, it's their big night. Uh, you know, Northern Ireland is dominated by uh, SMEs, and these guys coming through, are, these are the SMEs of the future. So, you know, Bank of Ireland UK is delighted to support businesses, of, you know, across all sectors, uh, growth sectors, growth businesses. So getting in on the ground floor, which Invent is, you know, that's really exciting. So uh, we're pretty sure there's going to be some pretty successful businesses coming out of tonight's uh, finalists, and they'll have great futures ahead. So. Uh, this is really exciting for us. So I'm here with Fiona at the Waterfront Conference Hall for Invent 2017. How are you feeling about this evening? I am a weird combination of nervous and excited all at once. Yeah, I can't wait. It's great. Fantastic. And what's this wonderful stuff? So Hug is a wearable heat pack. If you've ever tried to use a hot water bottle and get stuff done, then you'll know what it's like to need Hug. Um, you can heat it in the microwave or cool it in the freezer, so you can use it for sports injuries and things like that. But I per personally like to wear it around my waist. Wonderful. Yeah. And you are a finalist tonight, so that's a big yeah. deal and you've had lots of support. So yeah. how do you think things are going to go? I have no idea, but there's lots of opportunities to win things and I'm hoping our one minute pitch will be one of them. I'm really excited about that. Well, we wish you all the very best. Thank you very much. Thank you. Andrew, how are you feeling about this evening? Yeah, I'm pretty nervous, but I think it's going to be a good fun night. There's plenty of laughs to be had for our, what do you call it, our pitch coming up. I know, nervous. There's something, yeah, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. And Neve, tell us about Evie. This one looks wonderful. So Evie's a startup that we had from Queens. We started it in about January, February this year. Um, so Evie's a smart bag and app that allow you to track your everyday items. Um, so it's using simple RFID technology to remind you of any items you've forgotten so you can't leave the house or likewise can't leave it at work without like, coming home with it. So. Wonderful, I wish you all the very best this evening. Thank you very much, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Helen, congratulations. Tell me how it feels to win Invent Award 2017. It's an absolutely fantastic feeling. Um, it's a complete validation of our technology and the really strong team we've built around us. We spent years developing this technology and to get it out there and get that recognition, it's not just me, it's the team, really. Fantastic. And real breakthrough in, in terms of medicine? Yes, I mean, whenever I started my research group, I knew one of the key problems was that we needed to deliver the drugs to where they need to go. So that was really the challenge that I sought to try and solve over the last 10 years. Um, and to actually make this delivery system and to make variations of the delivery system that can take the drug to critical areas of where we want to go is just fantastic. Um, you can build the best drug in the world, but if you can't deliver it to where you want to go, there's no point having it. And what's next for you? Uh, <laughs> well, right now I'm probably going to go home and have a sleep. Um, but beyond that, um, actually we have pitches all over to do. Um, and we've got a lot of contracts with companies already in place. Um, we are heading over to Boston the next 10 days to kind of um, go over there and tell the world what we're all about over there. So it's, it's all very exciting. Well, we wish you all the very best. Thank you very much. Thank you.